Hello dear friends. This time I will do chemical reactor. That creates heat. And later a hand warmer based on it. To make a reactor need one wire. From stranded copper wire. Also need a thin rod. I take a needle from a syringe. I wind the wire around the needle, so that I get a spiral. Such a spiral can be made of any length, as long as the wire and patience are enough. The heating element can be of any shape and size. In a bottle of acetone for the experiment we'll need 2 milliliters. The amount of heat generated depends on fuel element size. Let's check together how long our reactor can produce heat from 2 milliliters of acetone. What you see is catalytic combustion or burning without open flame. Fuel was enough for almost 28 minutes of work. Heating element can be made of thicker wire. As a comedian spiral. Fuel tank is best taken from non-combustible material. And this one aluminum cap is excellent will fit. The duration of the reactor depends on how much the capacity is hot with acetone. The hotter it is the reaction is more intense, the fuel and then it's going to be faster. Let's look at how long it will work from 3 milliliters of fuel. Catalytic combustion has many advantages over fuel combustion and open flame. The first is that it can last a very long time. The second is that flameless combustion can occur in a small space, and a heating pad based on it can be integrated, for example, into the handle of a bicycle steering wheel or seat. The third advantage is that such a heating pad works without electricity and does not need batteries. The fourth is that on the basis of the catalytic thermo element, it is possible to construct a container for food or coffee and they will remain hot 
until the fuel runs out. I think you know that even the best thermos flask inevitably cools and does not produce heat. Fifth advantage is simplicity self-made heating element, and its cheapness. Oxidative property recovery reaction this bad smell, therefore I conduct this experiment in a ventilated room. Great, how hot works the element I showed, now proceed to making hand warmers. Brass pencil case, for sterilizing reusable syringes, and needles. As a case for a heating pad, you can take any aluminum container, of a suitable size, or even a capacitor case. From a piece of copper, I'll make a round plate. Not enough air. Yeah. These holes need products combustion went out, and fresh air got inside.
This spiral was not suitable, it did not support the reaction. Maybe this one will do. Yes, it normally supports combustion. Cut off the inside, and catalytic combustion became stably powerful, but I decided to add more ventilation holes. After the case warmed up to more than 35 degrees Celsius, I recorded the time and the hand warmer lasted 7 hours 45 minutes. This is a pretty good result for such a simple device. Thirty minutes after starting, the housing warmed up to 50 degrees Celsius, and this temperature was maintained until all the acetone evaporated. Friends, thanks for watching this video. Do not forget to rate it and share the link on social networks, and subscribe to the channel. Good luck.